You might just be the world's biggest Divergent fan, but how much do you know about Theo James? Hollywood insiders are calling this guy the next Brad Pitt, and hey, if that's not reason enough to get to know the British actor just a little bit more, then I don't know what is. So get comfy and join this party because right now we are breaking down seven things that most of you will not know about Mr. Theo James. Starting with this, at number seven, it's his name. Yes, the name Theo James sounds like sheer perfection, and it does fit quite nicely on movie posters, but I gotta burst your bubble here because as with all things, if it sounds too good to be true, it usually is. Theo's real name is Theodore Peter James Canard Tapticlis. Tapticlis is actually Greek, which explains why this guy could be the doppelganger of a Greek god. And from what we hear, he decided to go with Theo James because Theodore Peter James Canard Tapticlis didn't really roll off the tongue quite as well. All right, at number six, I think we need to talk about how exactly the hot Brit got his start acting. Well, the story goes that after getting his degree in philosophy at university, he decided to apply to acting school because that's what his girlfriend was doing. Well, he got in and she didn't and the rest is history. But does this dude use his philosophy background for his acting? Uh, I think, I mean, after I finished you know, university, I was like, Jesus, that was just a bunch of student debt for no reason. But I think in, <laughs> in retrospect, um, I think it's a certain way of thinking and it does give you a perspective, I hope, which can take you out of this kind of strange bubble that uh, sometimes we have to operate. But before Theo got his big break in Hollywood, he was pounding the pavement and working some pretty gross jobs. And that's what we've got at number five. Theo's most notable gig ever was his stint working for the National Health Service in England, where he went to the homes of the recently deceased and cleaned up bodily fluids left behind. Thank God things eventually did pan out for Theo, and this is an inside look at the Downton Abbey role that gave him his big break. Any Mary Crawley, I presume? You presume, right. Mr. Let me come to you tonight, please. I can't think what I have said that has led you to believe. I don't know when we'll meet again, so let it be tonight. I'm not what you think I am. If it's my mistake, if I've led you on, I'm sorry, but I'm not. And you are just what I think you are. Okay, first off, can we just say Babeville, UK right here? And secondly, this is a spoiler alert, I'm sure you noticed that things were getting pretty hot and heavy in that last scene. Well, yeah, Theo's character ended up dying while he was having sex with Lady Mary. I know it sucks, but hey, I mean, look on the bright side. Not many actors get that opportunity, right? And you gotta hand it to him. He's only in one episode and his character changes the entire course of the show. So bravo, Theo. Okay, moving right along. We know Theo is funny, he's charming, he's handsome, he's a great actor. But did you guys know that he does this? Upon the track of a thousand dreams, I walk through the wild only that's what it seems. When I stop to breathe the air, goes in my mouth, the fire in my head. Um, yeah, I know. I know what you're already thinking. How can someone so handsome be so gifted? Is this guy a unicorn or something? Well, after you watch this, most likely you'll be saying yes. Shailene on that one. So good. That was Theo performing first with his band Cher Khan and then straight up throwing it down in a little impromptu beatboxing. And just when you all were thinking to yourselves, this could not get any better. Well, my friends, did you know that Theo is also a trained dancer? We're talking tap, ballet, jazz, and yes, he can even do this at a party. <laughs> Case here. This guy sings, dances, he acts. 
what more is there? Well, there is social media. And at number one, one thing you probably don't know about Theo James is that while, I'm sorry ladies, he does have a long-term girlfriend named Ruth Kearney, he will admit to doing just a little bit of this. When was the last time you looked up an ex on Facebook? Fairly regularly. <laughs> You gotta love a guy who is down to straight up come clean about a little good old fashioned Facebook stalking. And you all out there, don't act like you don't do it too because we know that you do. All right, so I know this is a number seven list, but because I love you all so much, I'm gonna throw in this little last morsel for you all because Theo told Clever exclusively about a special feature in Divergent that didn't make it into the final cut of the movie. There is one shot of just one of my butt cheeks. But just it's one. yeah, it's, it's a very it's a kind of fleeting shot of just a single butt cheek, and it's kind of integral to the part. You must be in, it must be an action shot. Yeah, my my pants thing. fall down uh, as I'm jumping up to the train. You get to see a flash of bum. Tris raises one eyebrow and looks to the camera and says, "Yippee uh, ki yay, mother butt cheeks." FYI, that scene where Shay says, yippee ki yay, mother butt cheeks," is going to be included on the DVD release. So get excited. Okay, I have to come clean. It's actually not gonna be on the DVD release and it's not even real, but it would be pretty cool, right? And with that, that wraps up the seven things you didn't know about Theo James, but we know we probably missed some hidden gems, so feel free to hit the comment section to share everything you know. And click right on over here to watch our seven things you didn't know about Zac Efron sort of like a Greek god theme we have going on here. And be sure to subscribe for more pop culture action all the time. I'm Jocelyn Davis, thanks for watching, and we'll see you later.